In this video, I'm going to show you how to hide slash remove the add to cart button in WooCommerce in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is head over to WeSuite.com and go ahead and download and install the request a quote plugin. I'll leave the link in the description below. Once you've done so, head back over to your WordPress dashboard. Go ahead and navigate to plugins, add new, install and activate the plugin. Once you've done so, you'll see this WooSuite menu item here. Go ahead and select request a quote. Okay, and then we'll create our first rule. So we'll just click add rule. And then we can name this. Um, so for example, this is just for internal purposes only as well. So we'll just name it exactly what it is. So we'll say hide slash remove the add to cart button just so we know what it is. Can we can have multiple rules and then we need to choose who we want this rule to apply to. So we can set this rule to apply to guest users, which are all users logged out of your site, or we can set it for a specific user role. So for example, if we click select registered users, then we can select the user role in which we want this rule to apply to. In this case, I'm going to select guest users. So I'm going to select um, users which are logged out of our site. We want to hide the add to cart button and then we'll set the rule priority. Since there's no other rules, we'll just select one. So you can set it from one to 10, one being the highest, 10 being the lowest. Okay. And then here we get to select um, which product we want this rule to apply to. So let's say, for example, if you want it to apply to all products, then you'll just go ahead and enable this option here. So it will apply to all products, or you can select specific products, which you'll enter in here, or you can go ahead and hide the add to cart button from certain products within a particular category. In this case, you just go ahead and select the category from here. For this example, I'm going to hide the add to cart button from all products. So I just enable this option here. And then for the price, we have the option whether we want to hide the price or display it. I'm going to select no because we want to show the price. And then here where it says add to cart button, I'm going to select um, replace add to cart with custom quote button. Okay, so for the link, I'm going to leave it blank. Um, for the button as well, label, I'm going to leave it blank. So it's essentially hiding it. So let's go ahead and publish this rule. Since I'm logged in, this rule won't apply to me. So let's just double check this. Okay, as you can see, we, we can see the add to cart button fine. So let's go ahead and open up a private browser so we can see whether the rules working as it should. Okay, so here we are on the same shop page. And as you can see, there's no add to cart button. So we've got the price, we've got all the product information and so on, but there's no add to cart button. If you wanted, you can add a custom button or you can add a um, request a quote button as well. And that's how you hide slash remove the add to cart button within WooCommerce in just a few simple steps. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. All the links mentioned in this video will be in the description below. If you've got any questions, feel free to leave a comment or reach out to us and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.